What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what's up, what's good, what's poppin'? And if you've been here before, hey, welcome back. Today I'm gonna be doing a Halloween transformation. So I recreated this girl from the Extremely Goofy movie. So basically I'm the Barrett girl or the poet girl. Um, she, she has like a very cool, mellow style, like a bad, spicy type of look. I definitely say this look was very easy and inexpensive. I will have all the links to everything that I use down below. It's pretty much how she looked in the movie. She had a little hat with the little, you know, turtleneck. And then she's a dog. It's a dog movie, so <laughs> I did the nose. I'm gonna insert a picture either right here or right here of the girl so you guys can see, you know, how she looks and, you know, if I did a good job or not. Definitely do any type of red you want. This is definitely a fiery red. I have a separate video about this hair and how I did it and everything. So just go check it out. Forget to like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and turn your post notification bells on so you can be notified every single time I post. And without further ado, let's get straight into that. So I first want to just say thank you guys for watching this far because if you're watching this far, that means you're intrigued. And I also want to say I'm not a makeup guru. Um, so yeah, just bear with me. <laughs> this look will be a very light, you know, quick beat if you want to say so yeah you just want to um start off by wiping off your face with some alcohol pull your hair back out of your face that's pretty much what i'm doing and first we want to start off with the eyebrows so i got this red pencil from the resupply store the exact color of the pen will be in my description box below um now i'm just you know cleaning up my eyebrows I definitely recommend, you know, cleaning up your eyebrows before you do them just so that your eyebrows could come out, you know, at its best. Um, now I am just, you know, filling in my eyebrows, brushing them in, filling them in. I'm not trying to put too much red on my eyebrows because I don't want them to be too bright. Um, but yeah, I'm going to show you guys a little trick towards the end. That would help darken, you know, the red tone a little bit. Now I'm taking the color Fawn and concealer and I am, you know, concealing up my eyebrows, lining them up, um, giving them that freshly done, you know, vibe. Um, there's the comparison between one eyebrow and the other. I wasn't 100% done with that eyebrow, but, you know, I was showing you how it was beginning to look. Now I just took some coconut oil and I just rubbed it on my face. Um, one side of my face had a little bit of concealer on it already where all my dark spots was. I was just letting that sink in. Now I'm using the Stay Matte NYX cons I mean, foundation. I'm sorry. And, you know, I'm dabbing some of that on my face. I don't usually, you know, put a lot of foundation on my face. Um, mostly because I don't really like you know to look cakey and like too makeupy i don't know i just really just don't like the dark spots on my face um yeah so now i'm just you know going over my eyebrows again because they kind of got lost after i you know put my foundation on or whatever now i'm just taking a little bit of my black you know eyebrow stuff and i'm just you know mixing it in to my eyebrows just to give it that you know darker complexion and then I am going in with my eyeliner. I'm not really an eyeliner pro yet. Um, so, you know, this video is definitely going to be in the books. You know, you know, in the future, I'll be able to watch this video and be like, dang, I came a long way. But right now, this is where I'm at with it. <laughs> so, yeah, now you're going to take a darker concealer and you're just going to try to line your nose just to give your nose that, you know, skinnier illusion. Or whatever and yeah you're gonna dab that in a little bit because you don't want it to look too blocky and too chunky now we're gonna line our lips yay so the color that I had I actually hated it it was really red and I actually hate my lips being red um, I ended up stop you know showing you guys how I did that cuz I just hated it I, did, I really didn't even like my lips I, I didn't like them, but yeah so yeah we're lining up the lips or whatever and now we are 
doing the nose now the nose is basically the whole face costume <laughs> um you really need, need a steady hand for this nose part i realized that shortly um that my hand was way too wobbly and i had to hold my hand with my other hand just to keep it steady but yes you're basically just drawing I would probably say that this shape starts off being a triangle and then it turns into a oval. Yes. Excuse the noise in the back, guys. Yeah, that's pretty much what that shape is. <laughs> like, it starts off like a triangle and then it turns into like an oval at the bottom. Um, yeah, and then you're just going to want to start filling that in. And, you know, I actually use concealer to, you know, clean it up. Whatever parts I messed up on, I just used the concealer to go around it to give it that, you know, clean look. And, yeah, pretty much that's how I did it. And then I just, you know, filled it in. And there's your dog nose. Now we're going to take some highlights. Um, and we're just going to highlight underneath our eyebrows, a little bit on our cheeks, you know, on our nose, above our lips. And, you know, just going to highlight wherever you feel like you want to highlight. Just highlight. So now it's on to the eyeshadow. Um, she actually had like a purplish color, you know, on her eyes. So I'm just using my Sephora eye palette and I'm choosing the, you know, purple color towards the bottom you know for my eyeshadow um i really didn't wasn't trying to do nothing too fancy um i was just really just trying to you know do the whole purple eyeshadow i didn't do any you know three coats of eyeshadows or any smoky eyes or none of that i just put the purple on my eyes because yeah i just did that <laughs> So yeah, now I'm pretty much mixing it in. Make sure you guys are mixing it in, mixing it in, making it get fluffy and, you know, natural. Here, I did the dumbest shit ever, but we're not even going to talk about that. We're just going to, you know, leave it in the box where we don't talk about things. Unless you guys comment and ask what I was trying to do. <laughs> yeah, um, we're just going to pretend that didn't happen. So now I'm putting my sweater on. And I'm brushing my hair and I'm putting my hat on. This is basically my little costume or whatever. Um, everything I'm wearing is pretty inexpensive. And yeah, you know, it was a really easy, you know, cute. Very, very easy. So if you really don't have a Halloween costume and you really want one, but you don't really want to do too much and you know, it's probably Halloween already or Halloween's probably tomorrow. I would definitely recommend this look. It's like super easy and super cute. And that's pretty much how you get the look. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Some things I did leave out. Make sure you guys me putting on my eyelashes, open on blush, or turn on lip gloss, but everything else like my eyebrows and my eyeshadow. I showed you guys how I did that. Yeah, this look is very dope for like um, a Halloween party or even if you're just trying to go out for Halloween with your friends, not even at a party, just like, you know, around the Halloween season, if you want to look cute, but you, wanna, you don't want to do too much of the crazy makeup look. I think this is a cute, you know, this is definitely a cute way to go, you know? Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And make sure you guys turn on your post notification bell so you guys can be notified every single time I post. See you guys on the next video.